What's going on people? Runner Bean back here with another video. Today is the third vlog of the series. So we've got an easy run on the beautiful hills where I live. It's a lovely morning. So we're gonna have a run round and we're gonna have a chat whilst we go. Hope you enjoy. So as you guys can see, we are halfway up. <laughs> um, it's an absolutely brutal climb, but the views are absolutely superb. Probably one of the best, best views in the valley, to be honest. So over there, we have Calp Reservoir. Over there, we have a little town called Stacksteads and Bake Up. And then over there you have Burnley, Rotten Stall. So let's carry on with the run. It's an absolutely brutal climb to the top. It really does take the wind out of you, especially when you're carrying a, a gear. So at some point, I am expecting it to get rather muddy. There's beautiful views at the top. Get to the top. I'll show you a bit more about the place. So there we go, we've reached the top, finally, beautiful views, it's a little bit windy, as you can probably hear. So we've just looped round from the top, come along the bottom road and as you can see by the videos it's very 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 muddy. I'm having to constantly watch my footing because it's so muddy and slippy. So I'm trying not to break my ankles <laughs> and get another injury. On the injury front, luckily nothing happened, I was absolutely fine. Um, I couldn't walk the day after very well but we're actually good so as we, it's not quite as windy where i am right now i'll give you a little bit of a lowdown on the last couple of days so on saturday i thought i got injured luckily we were okay but i missed out the sunday run just to make sure that i wasn't doing any extra damage to myself on monday i managed to get out for an eight miler which was good it's at 650 pace and then on tuesday we was able to get a 10 miler done at 606 is on the Our next marker point which is the reservoir which is just over there we've ran to the bottom of a hill we're keeping this run quite short it's probably going to be about four miles four and a bit miles these are the views and yeah so now we're running one of the steeper parts and i'm running at nine minute miling the wind has died down a little bit, which is good. Makes it a bit easier, but that bit was tough. So I'll see you guys when we get to the reservoir. So here we are at the reservoir. 
reservoir we are going to get closer you probably can't even hear me and yeah we're going to do another time lapse because i think they look awesome so check it out so we're just going to take a quick break down by the reservoir um, we're currently four miles in been out for quite a while trying to do all these videos and shoots but it's all worth it in the end i enjoy it so the plan for the next couple of weeks is to keep the mileage up get the time trial in next week hopefully aim for somewhere between 15 20 and 15 40 in a race i'm probably looking like low 15s which is really good for me it'd be a massive pb if i could the plan for the rest of the day is to just get home. I'm going to clean my car because it's absolutely filthy. We're going to just chill out, get some food in, replenish those carbohydrates and have a bit of protein before we get out for our next run. And the plan for the rest of the week is I've got a session tomorrow. I'm not really sure. This is going to be posted probably on like Friday or something. So it's going to be behind time. But we've got a session planned for tomorrow. On Friday, we've got another easy run probably about eight miles at this point in the clip i'm just waffling about a training session that's never going to happen so i've decided that i'm going to do the time trial on monday because it's the best weather so we'll see how that goes i also want to take this time to just let people know that i do have a tiktok um i do post quite a lot on it i do little clips of the videos that are coming up on the youtube I put the name of the username just here so that you can go and follow it if you like and catch up with what I post because I post quite a lot. I'd also like you guys to go and press that subscribe button. It keeps me heavily motivated in what I'm doing. It does take quite a lot of effort to come out and do all these videos, especially in the winter and it's very, very cold. I do have to do all my editing and all my videos on my days off. So I do use all of my day off to pretty much do all of this. And those who have subscribed, I really, really appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. But other than that, I'm going to make my way home now and get warm. So I'll post the rest of the clips now and you can check them out and we'll do an outro at the end. Careful. <laughs> So guys, it does seem as though the wind has calmed down, so we can do a bit of a brief on our way back. So the total for this run is going to be around about five miles. Um, it's like nine minute pace because it's really boggy over the tops. And yeah, as you can see, we're on grass the whole way. So yeah, um, hopefully you're enjoying these videos. So the next video I do is going to be the 5k time trial that I plan to do next week, weather permitted. Um, so stay tuned for that. And then the video after that is going to be an 800 meter training set, like week broken down for what I would normally do in summer, um, trying to get race fit. So that's going to be the video after the 5k one. Um, so yeah, that's going to be the next two videos i'm currently on my descent on the way back down it's a lot less windy now which is which is good and then in the future we're going to have 1500 meter sessions that i do 1500 meter weeks that i do um, and then we'll cover a bit of winter stuff seeing as we are still in winter this isn't a normally a typical run for me i don't normally run on the hills but you know we've started the vlog so I thought it'd be interesting rather than running on the roads with videos. I'm not really a big fan of mud, to be honest. Um, I try and avoid it at every possible situation. So guys, I'm back where I started. This is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate all your support. If you haven't subscribed, please press that subscribe button because we are going to have plenty more videos, plenty more in-depth videos, plenty more training videos. You know, I want to help you guys out as much as, as much as physically possible. Give you guys motivation and inspiration during the tough times that we're going through at the moment. So if you could give this video a like, I'd really appreciate that. Any questions, put them in the comments below and I'll answer them and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Take care and have a great week. Bye bye.